Morning Sports Report brought to you by Hobby Habit, 411 First Street in Legrand. Go check them out. They have Traxxas RC. They have uh, the biggest Lego selection in Eastern Oregon. The store is absolutely amazing. Joe and his team have done a great job updating it. it they have Magic the Gathering cards. They have Kandamas. They have STEM supplies for, for your kids. And, man, it's just the they've done a great job. Hobby Habit in Legrand, just for the fun of it. On Tuesday, the LHS girls soccer team lost in the opening round of the playoffs, one nothing to North Bend right here at Community Stadium. And that pretty much wraps up the fall sports season for the high school, except for cross country. And they run in the state championship this weekend. Um, EOU cross country will be running their conference championship this weekend in Caldwell. Um, I think the men's team is number six in the country and the women's team is receiving votes. So they're right outside the top 25. I sat down with CCC runner of the week, Lauren Mitchell this week. And here's a little clip of that. Um, what are you going to school for? Uh, exercise science. Exercise science. What do you want to be when you grow up? Um, I originally wanted to be an athletic trainer, but I just, I don't really know anymore. I'm like leaning more towards that again. But what had you leaning away from it? You see the hours they have to put in up there? Kind of, yeah. It's a grind, <laughs> it is man. A lot. They work their butts off. Yeah. And I just know, like, with, like, a family and stuff, that's, like, a lot. And so. Yeah, talk to Chris about that. Yeah. I mean, it's, it, it's a it's a tough job, man. Mm -hmm. I don't, I mean, I couldn't imagine doing it. They're, they're there all the time. They are, yeah. And traveling and just mm -hmm. everything. Um, so, for you personally, um, do, you, uh, do you like pineapple on pizza? Um, I'll eat it. No, eat you wouldn't order anything. it though. You're going to go in and order a Hawaiian pizza. Probably not. What's your favorite food? Uh, probably like a good beef steak. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's, I mean, that's yeah. <laughs> you like lean ones or do you like, like ribeye? Like one uh, with nice marbling? I like like ribeye. Yeah, me yeah. too. <laughs> By far. Yeah. So those, those interviews will probably come out Friday, maybe Monday. Um, we'll see. I, I'm going to sit down with the wrestlers today and do the wrestling preview show. EOU football is at home this weekend on Saturday against SOU for su senior day. So they're going to celebrate their seniors. That's a one o'clock kickoff at Community Stadium. That should be fun. The EOU football team, their record doesn't necessarily reflect it, but they're they're good. They're, they've really turned the corner in the last two weeks in a row. They've been within one score of beating two top 10 teams. And and just that alone signifies that this team has gotten better. They started 0-4, and, and they've won two of four since. And both of the games that they lost have been just, you know, close games, that a couple of bounces, and, and they win that game. So get out there and support them and check it out. Uh, EOU men's and, men's and women's wrestling are at home this weekend. They wrestle Evergreen, the men, at 3 o'clock on Saturday. The women wrestle Evergreen at 4 o'clock on Saturday. And then the men turn around and wrestle Corbin at 5 on Saturday. And then on Sunday, both teams host the Mountaineer Open. So a whole weekend of wrestling up at Quinn. Go check it out. I think so on Saturday, they're wrestling in Quinn. And then on Sunday, they're going to wrestle in the field house, which is, which is kind of cool. We have that extra facility where we can host events, and it's pretty cool. Um, the number three EOU volleyball team goes on the road this weekend. They play Walla Walla on Saturday. They play LCSC on Friday. If they win both of these games, they clinch the regular season CCC championship, and they also earn the right to host the CCC tournament, which was huge. Um, not only just ticket revenue, but also being at home. We have the best student section in volleyball in the whole conference, and, and it's a huge advantage for the EOU volleyball team to play at home. So, I mean, they shouldn't have any trouble beating LCS and Walla Walla, both lower level teams in the conference. And and so that'll be exciting because the CCC tournament here is super exciting. And then if we, it, as, as the winner of the league, we'll most likely get a home game in the opening round of the of the uh, national tournament too, which is always exciting because that's a team from another part of the country that comes in and plays us here, and, and we have great fans up there. Um, yeah, so the sports report is brought to you by Hobby Habit here in Legrand. Go check them out, 411 First Street.